Hi guys, uh, so in today's vlog I have set myself a challenge for you guys uh, to cook a student meal for two people uh, using under five pounds, so that's two pound fifty per person. And we're going to use all the ingredients from Kingston Market and we'll use like Sainsbury's basic range and then um, I'll show you how to cook it in a bit. It's usually a lot cheaper if you come to the market as opposed to like going to Sainsbury's to get your uh, fruit and veg because you can get, instead of buying packets of stuff, you can get like individual things. So let's see how cheap we can get like mushrooms. What do you get for that? I think this will be fine. Do you reckon? I got, that was 60p. So that's pretty good. Pretty good so far. We're doing well. So I've just got back from the market and I've got my mushrooms which were like 60p which is pretty good. Then I went to Sainsbury's and I got basic uh, spaghetti, basic bacon, um, some single cream um, and I already had uh, like a couple of eggs and some cheese so I'll show you those ingredients in a minute. Oh yeah and uh, the thing we're going to be cooking today is uh, a simple carbonara and it was a recipe that another student from Kingston uh, gave me. She's Italian so hopefully it should be uh, sort of authentic although I'm using cheddar cheese rather than like like a hard cheese like parmesan or whatever because that's that wasn't really in my budget. Um, so yeah let's start cooking. I've got some mushrooms there, some streaky bacon, uh, spaghetti, single cream, a couple of eggs. We're just going to be using the egg yolks uh, from the eggs. Uh, a little bit of cheese and um, some garlic. And you don't have to add the garlic, but I quite like um, a bit of garlic, so it gives it a bit of flavour. I really advise, uh, I got this for Christmas actually, but I really advise investing in one of these. It's just a garlic crusher and it saves your fingers like smelling loads and it saves a load of time like peeling it and chopping it up. All you need to do is put that straight into the garlic. So you can actually, I could probably get all three of these in. Um, and once I come to put the mushrooms in, I just crush the garlic straight in with the mushrooms. separate the yolks um, from the white. This is probably like maybe the trickiest bit and I'm not very good at it. I'm, I'm just like, I can just about do it okay. So I'll just show you how I do that quickly. It's still cooking. I can just quickly grate a bit of cheese and then we're pretty much done. Um, so whilst you're just waiting for that last bit of uh, pasta to cook, you can just get on with some of the dishes um, and then no time is wasted. Um, what I also do is I leave um, just a little cup of extra starchy water, just in case you want it slightly more fluid uh, when you when you finish it off. So a little extra cup of starchy water. Drain the pasta off into here. what it looks like and it's really really easy it's it takes literally it took me about 15 minutes it's under five pounds because uh, you know I only used two of the eggs I used about an eighth of the cheese um, and just use all the basic range at Sainsbury's or whatever and you'll be absolutely fine so I hope you enjoyed watching and uh, keep an eye out for my next vlog <laughs>